Hello everybody, welcome to Perfect Vermin. I uh, was watching a video about gross games, and uh, he said he would spoil this game, so I figured I'd try it out for myself. I already have it a little bit spoiled, but I won't spoil you, don't worry. <sighs> Probably gonna need to adjust that sensitivity just a bit. Wow, these graphics are really good. Whoops, I went too far. Let's put sensitivity back there. Oh yeah, it seems good enough. Alright, my controller might be drifting a slight bit. As you can see. <laughs> wow, you can even break the, the thing. Yeah, so this game is about hitting things with hammers. Wow. This game is sick. I mean, I knew it looked good from, from the video, but... How would you design something like this? I mean, it's got like the basic office building look down. I kind of want to go back to options and turn up the sound effects for the smash. Ah, cool. <laughs> That's what computers look like. Oh, I can't fully smash the stapler. This is so sad. A little bit of problems with the uh, geometry, but that's all right. Smack all of them, even the smackaroni. It says five in the corner. Toilet. Get out of here, toilet. Oh yeah, that, that was the spoil thing, that uh, some of them are filled with gets. Ooh, you can smash the keyboards. You know, it's like my main man Weird Al always says, my electronic keyboard never leaves me bored. Aw, are those two diglets in love? Die, Diglets. <laughs> oh, did I, did I not smash this yet? Oh, I can get on top! It's like Stanley Parable. Wait. Can I? Oh, you can smash it into smaller bits for some of the objects. I do have some blood left on my hammer. So some of the furniture is meaty furniture. Probably or more meaty furnitures. What was that? That was a weird noise. There might be a time limit on this. Hopefully not. So the big chunks you can hit so that they get out of the way. Definitely gotta smash this coffee cup. It's really... Of all things to be indestructible, a coffee cup. You can breathe on those wrong and they'll break. Alright, so you do have to press the button each time. I was kind of curious if like holding it down did anything special. Nice. Yeah, you can really fracture this stuff. I wish there were more windows to break. Okay, I can't break the cubicle walls. You would think those would be breakable though, because uh, typically they are not constructed very well. I could be wrong about that though. Imposter. 
What does this one say? Smiley? No smile. Only, only death does my hammer ring. Alright, that is not a meaty computer. That is a normie computer. Disintegrated. One more. Ooh. Gotta get the light bulbs, that's the most important one. Aw, oh, the, the plant still survives. That is one hardy plant. Slam. <laughs> oh, who hasn't wanted to do this? Oh wow, I think I saw some teeth there. Imposter. I wonder what the speedrun for this looks like. Oh, I broke that whole window with one smash. And it was a long one. Bonk. Bonk. Yo! Wait, you can boost yourself? Okay. Game has all sorts of surprises. Alright, so I got spoiled that some of the furniture is blood furniture. Filled with tasty meat. No, no smoking sign. These soap dispensers, like, it would be kind of fun to break one of those with a baseball bat in real life. Just take it right off the wall. Ooh, this one's occupied. Imposter toilet. <laughs> I can knock off the toilet paper. What's the deal with, like, the... Hmm. I wonder if there's, like, a way... Because, like, that one was occupied, so there's a way to figure out where the imposter was. So maybe those other chairs were, uh... Like, findable. Ooh, that one was nice. Because I do want to smash everything. that? Oh my gosh, why is that so hard? <laughs> There's something kind of weirdly peaceful about this though. one I can't hammer. Computer. Alright, so is there anything in here that looks like it doesn't belong? I don't see anything. I kind of want to see if I can figure out what's uh, the imposter. This plant would aggravate you if you were sitting there. Okay, it's not that. Hmm. Maybe it's like in the fridge? Nope. Apple? Oh, <laughs> I just destroyed the whole thing. I just wanted to hit the apple. Oh. Return to the elevator so you can try this again. Let me finish up real quick. Oh, 
bad. Maybe I don't want to go to the elevator. What am I getting stuck on? <laughs> Grody. So I'm guessing I probably have a choice here. I could either do elevator. Today, please. I could either do elevator or maybe try to get in the uh, that other door. See if it's open now. Get this dude off my screen. I'm doing important work. Smash. <laughs> Get owned. Yeah, very satisfying gameplay. Let's go look for that door we can open. Wasn't over here. Probably not in this one. Yeah, there's blood in there. Bloody blood, blood, blood. There it is. This door is probably significant. I guess we can uh, oblige this strange gentleman. I uh, find myself in times of trouble. Ooh, time limit. They hide poorly. I think most of them are chairs. Don't let them spread. Oh, now I'm kind of curious what the fail condition is like. I keep killing though. I don't think there was anything in there. Oh, might not have enough time. There's definitely one in the bathroom. <laughs> Building is more chambers that need cleansing. Return to the elevator. Alright, we're schmoovin'. Where to next, buddy? Oh, we're back to full screen mode. Never mind. No nonsense this time. Do your job. Alright. Probably if I want to do this fast. Press them, they do not feel pain, keep going. Gotcha. Good info. Got this one. Oh gosh, there's a lot of them here. Kinda doubt they're in the windows. Seems like it's only chairs. Yeah, that are full of blood. Ooh, another bathroom. That's probably a good sign. Alright, they're not quite so obvious. Yeah, none of the toilets in here.
looking. It's waiting for you. All right. Oh shoot, did I mess up? Or did I get it? Alright, gotta be faster. We're getting pretty solid though. I think it was this one. No, it was this one, because it's, it's at a different angle. Oh, it's the one that's in the alleyway. Right. Oh wow, that was clean. I mean, obviously not clean, but, you know. It's waiting for you. I wonder what it's waiting for me. Probably something cool. <laughs> I missed the chair and I accidentally broke a whole desk. Classic gamer problems. Oh, this room probably. Yeah, I didn't get to finish checking it. Alright, no chair in there. It's another gamer problem. I don't think it's in here then. Maybe it is a window. So that's one I haven't checked. How is that chair intact and all those others? Oh gosh, I'm running out of time. Alright. There must be something I'm not seeing. This room is clean, I don't have to worry about this one. Yeah, those two are like right next to each other. Oh, the desk is an awkward spot, okay. Yeah, so it's all about what's not supposed to be there. So this room, everything's right. This room also looks like everything's right. So I probably shouldn't waste my time in here, just to be sure. And this one, there's a chair in the bathroom, so that's not ideal. Probably gonna be something where it's not supposed to be. And he got the bathroom one. There we go. That took longer than expected. Sorry, bud. Need you to work faster. Turn to the elevator. The next floors are contaminated. So I might deem that there's more than five. That dude is not looking too great. Gotta be a little bit faster to help him out. This floor's geometry has become uncooperative. Work quickly. Oh, neat. Yeah, everything looks like it should be here. Oh, is this a mirror of the first floor? Alright, that one seems off. All these chairs look right. I don't think it's this room. Oh, it is that table. Okay. Because that's a conference room table, not a kitchen table. Okay. Yeah, I think this is a mirror because that's the same toilet that was occupied. Oh, that one. Yeah, that one is in the aisle. It's harder to see when they're upside down, though. Keep hitting the chairs, because they're all chairs. The imposters. I'm running out of time. Oh, there's a second chair! 
Wait, what? Why is there chairs underneath? Okay, I might be wasting my time with all the chairs. Shoot. Alright, second try. Getting pretty good. I can't just be hitting all the chairs though. It's too slow. Maybe there was a second. That's one. Two. Three. Nothing else looks out of the ordinary. Four. Okay, yeah, so we got two in this room. Got one left. Uh, that's where I started out. That all seems like a bait. Yeah, I think that's a bait. Okay, good. That was the right one. Hey, buddy. Let's go. Wow, even that's upside down. I don't remember where I came from. Please go. Oh. Wonder if he's hurting. You know, you could, like, give me directions. Where the heck did I come from? What? I... Oh, okay. My controller's dragging. I'm gonna wait and see if he says anything cool. Mr. Desk. The Mr. Desk Man. Wait, Mr. Desk Man, he's sitting in a chair. And chairs are the bad guys. Or I'm the bad guy. It's with the circle in the top left. Oh, that's where the numbers used to be, right? Alright, Mr. Desk Guy, let's give it another go. Let me at him. Okay, so I think I have to control both at once. <laughs> this is pretty neat. Wait, did I kill something on the other? I'm just looking at the screen. Okay, that's the only one in here. I already got this. Shoot. Alright, let's move to the other screen. Oh, time limit's the same. Okay, that's a bit rough. normal in there. That was a bait, I think. I already got something in here. Hmm. 
Okay, let's just do five in order, maybe. That might be easier. One. Two. Bruh. Three, four, I might have already gotten the one in here. Five, okay, so now I can switch. No way, an unbroken door and there was nothing in it? Shoot. Alright, let's do left first this time. Makes it so much harder. I mean, that's in a weird spot, but I guess it's not an imposter. Okay, that's everything. Wait, there's something on that window, wasn't there? Maybe it is a window then, for the last one. That's done. There's definitely something on that window. I guess it doesn't count. Oh! Toilet. Right. That makes sense. No smoking. I always hated my mother. I lived in terror of becoming like her. 
What horrible comedy that in the end I even die like her. Twisted by hate and desire. I was cruel to you before. Your task was always impossible. My hope was never fair. This is an explanation of my hate. I offer no excuse. Do not worry yourself with the timer. It is not for you. Oh shit. I am being unborn. And once again I am amused by the simple beauty of colors. Such abstract and fleeting things. I will unknow them. It was good to live. It was good. If only I had more time. Can I save him? Might be too late. That won't stop me from trying though. Oh shit. It's the plant! Uh. Oh. This guy probably has lung cancer. Oh. Wait, the door opened. Mr. Spitz, please sit down. We need to discuss your test results. It's been an accident, a massacre downtown. It, that will have to wait. No, this will wait. There are people dying. You are dying. It's what we had feared. The cancer is spread, it's now. What's happening in that office downtown is the perfect story. It's what I'll be remembered for. I have to go. We'll treat this cancer. Can wait. If it was just in your pancreas alone, it would be inoperable. But it spread to your liver, your lungs, even your bones. By our estimates, you have four to six months. You need to start putting your affairs in order. I don't have time for this. People need me. This is the story of my career and my life. I can't ignore it. You can't walk out of this office and have this all just go away. No one will care about my death if I don't prove to them that I lived. That was a cool game. I ruined it by burping. This is life. Daniel Shaipilov. Alright, who made the graphics though? Oh, that's it. That was an interesting. Oh, Angad Matharu did level design. Special thanks. Oh, it's alphabetical by first name. I haven't seen that done. Lame boy. Who is lame boy? Plus everyone we forgot. Classic! <laughs> so, uh... This game, what are my thoughts on it? It was very good. Mechanically, visually. Storytelling. Sound effects, music. That was, uh... Really something. So I guess the newsman wanted me to, to massacre the office building because he needed to prove that he had lived. But then at the end of it all, 
He realized that he became like his mom, I guess. So in the end, I was just a instrument of brutality. Cool game. Very cool game. And the whole time limit thing, I really like that. How it lets the player, like, uh... Like, explore the first one on their own time, and then they replay it with a timer. And, you know, they either remember it or that's when they figure out the whole imposter thing. And it kind of serves as, like, a difficulty... I don't know what the word is. Like, it makes it harder. <laughs> But, uh, it also kind of makes you anxious with the timer, which fits for the style of game that's going for. And the number in the corner counting down, you know, at the start you're like, what does this 5 mean? Is that my health or whatever? But no. It's the amount of... Imposter chairs and refrigerators and toilets and doors. I got so confused when I saw the door one, I just like stared at it. I was like, didn't I break this door already? <laughs> Interesting game. Guess you can't run from cancer. Although he gave it his all. So, you can say that for a newsman. Very cool game. Yeah, so if you enjoyed Perfect Berman, leave a like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Peace out.